Oh no, I, I, was, I didn't check Murloc Joe's stream. Is he even not streaming? Oh god, he's gonna, he's gonna beat me. Because <laughs> he's got a wizard. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. He's just gonna win. Hope he was trying to s snipe the ogres and got fucked. But um, as if he's kept the movement 5 thrower. I can't say I'm a fan of that. You know, pro on the blitzer instead of... I thought he'd have taken jugs. At least I've got a couple of tackle now. To deal with fucking movement 9. Sidestep catcher. And got plenty of, plenty of reserves. Ogres niggled to beat him up. He's got a very good record with his team though. 15-3-1, very good record. you will probably scum all his money as well, won't you? <laughs> That's frog, man. Oh, man. Yeah, the Niggle Ogre is a huge target, isn't he? Nah, no, it's still still not updated, uh, Goblin Spy. I'm still on 13-9-1. Wow, so that's something like nine two zero the last few games. That's really good. I'm like nine two one last few games. Christmas man, obviously, 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 gonna get the wizard. Dirty dingo. Hmm. Yeah, maybe I should have sat on the team. Bribe, dirty dingo, dirty dingo, getting some. Has he even got a dirty player? No, he does. Fuck. I've got a dirty player for his pommel, though. Oof. Fucking humans, man. This is going to be an embarrassing loss. <laughs> and then baby obviously you spend all his money why not oof I guess my, my chaos shouldn't be scared of anyone though really should they I didn't check if he was streaming because I just thought well my chaos They'll wreck anybody, won't they? <laughs> but maybe they won't wreck every anybody. Everybody. He's going all in, just pretend it's poker. Yeah, all right. Hundred <laughs> percent record of poker, pretty good. Come on, just win the toss, just win the toss, just win the toss. Oh, baby. Let's look for the turn two concession victory. I thought he was just going to fully, <laughs> fully just backline it then and <laughs> give up. Movie. <laughs> ah, Ogre Mirror. No, 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 it was a. Uh, I had my Ogres on to make it look like I was spinning with my Ogres. This is a nice little simple snipe shield. I guess he's not too happy about it either, though, is he? So. Oh, 
Put him in there, blitz him. be good, you never know. Ah yes, Crumsley, thank you for telling me. Wait, did I leave someone good on the bench? No, thank God. <laughs> Don't like I've just destroyed my own LOS. <laughs> Frenzy, does he? How can he get to? Quite far, why can he get to quite far? I can always push them forward next turn. I stand up all my <laughs> stand up all my guys. <laughs> Yeah, that's everything in it, every result there is. <laughs> Jim Power, a stunner KO and a Kaz, yeah. Yeah, Kazing him was really good. Oh no, it's a Murloc Joe Pylon situation. Only when he's broken AV. The cars, chummy cunt. <laughs> okay, no. Oh, 
bonehead. Get the dirty player on, isn't it? Is he gonna plus two foul even though he's a mm, wow. Well. Guess he's got the bribe. <laughs> Lucky dingo. Kind of blots on him or something's okay, but I think I've got to deal with this guy. Try to power him. Don't really want to stand him up to get blocked. <laughs> And pond, and same with him. But then they're just going to get fouled if if they're not. At least this way, they might not get fouled. <laughs> Thanks, last Pokemon. Humans are the bashiest team, it's it's a fact. Armor 8 though, I mean he's got mighty blow against armor 8, so it's not surprising, is it? It's fully not surprising. Oh man, I shouldn't have played this game. I shouldn't have spun again. It's not even fucking surprising, is it? Right. <laughs> Just in case. Joe thinks he's funny. <laughs> Minus AG is keepable. Minus AV isn't really keepable, but minus AG is keepable. Yeah. yeah, I probably shouldn't have stood up, but I knew he was going to make a massive foul. So. That was the thing, wasn't it? Just, no, I'm just fucked. Apple's gone. Now he's definitely staying down.
How much fucking guard does he want? Holy shit. Can one dice him. And then one dice him. Turns out my team actually isn't very good, is it? Fireballs coming in this turn. For sure. Straight up. I don't even care. Might just concede. <laughs> Might just concede. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the look spectrum is is pretty crazy. Glorious. But yeah, I wish I hadn't activated because now I've got to, I've got to play them again, haven't I? Two cards including a perm in two turns. Yeah, is is equals what I've done in entire games from Corp. I mean that is absolutely true. <laughs> And it also, I I pile on every time. Unlike uh, unlike Murloc Jaw, who piles on only when it's prudent to do so. I just pile on like a fucking lunatic, and still don't make two cards in a whole game. <laughs> but yeah, the, the big ones, the big ones, the perm, isn't it? The block guy isn't such a big miss. He got just too much guard, hasn't he? I need to remove some players. No, he didn't make a power. He'll greed it. Yeah. Obvious. Oh no, it's pro. Oh no. Oh yeah. So it's another pile on. No, no, he got it. Okay, good. At least my guy didn't fucking die. Face the ball. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. Holy shit. Yeah, that's true. Last fog, man. Pro. Fucking green, man. This is fucking pathetic. This I'm on the right. It's sad that I'm the Kill Chaos team and it's my drive and he can just herb dirt base me like a fucking idiot because he's just got such a fucking strength and guard advantage. Like what is up with that? How is that even even fucking happened? Oh 
I literally have to blitz this guy to get two dice on him. Fucking hell. Two cursed warriors, KO'd strength beast. Compared to some turds. Well, no on hands, it's the fact that he made the removal and then he made the stun with a foul as well, wasn't it? If he hadn't stunned with a foul, which he wasn't likely to stun, um, then everything would have been a lot better. Oh, wow, well, Calder, you're so clever. Good for you. That's why you're not a fan, because of course, in the 35 games, where you lose two. <laughs> the one game where you uh, where they make a lucky stun and a lucky chasm turn one, that's why you don't like it. I can see, good good point. Can't argue with that logic. Actually, can't power him out and down some fucking man. Double GF fight to hit him. Doesn't really achieve anything though, does it? Could blitz him. That's only one dice though, so he would have to. Oh god, the frenzy is actually a fucking negatory, isn't it? At the moment. Oh, well, I can't even one dice him. Could blitz him. But what would it achieve? Nothing. Making two GFIs to get here is like making the three plus, but anyway, I guess I've got to do it. Fuck, fuck, fuck. That wasn't so clever, was it? 
as it turns out. As it turns out, that positioning there was horrible. This makes it all right. No. Oh god, that was a fuck up. Goblin masks. Oh, jelly deals. Oh man, how bad was that? I just let him get two dice. Huh? If I'd gone there, it'd been all right because I, uh, I couldn't reroll the one dice though. But so I, I don't know. Maybe I kind of needed to do, do both. <laughs> yeah, there's no way I would snipe Joe with this team. I am fucked, Jelly, yeah. I am fucked. He's, he's out damaged me. Despite infinite pylon might pylons, clone palm versus mighty blow, mighty blow is the winner. He's just got infinite guard and I've got none. Oh man, if he wants here. Fucking lack of block, that's why I'm playing this fucking game. Oh you bell end. What a fucking pointless game. Right, I'm gonna ban Kyle Duda. <laughs> nah, I don't need you as I said anything since then. That wound me up so much. That wound me up so much. Like, it's fucking hell, it's so crass and it's so common. This is why I don't do this for the one game in a million where I get dice to fuck. I won't say I'm tilted, I'm just pissed off. <laughs> Block first, good. It's hard enough getting dice to fuck, but then for someone to act like a smart ass at the same time, it's just shit, isn't it? Can't even get the third dice. How bad do I feel not being able to pile on anymore? Maybe I should have just gone for the surf. Rather than whatever the fuck this is. <laughs> Thanks, Tony. <laughs> oh, shit. <sighs> what a fucking shit game. I really didn't want to receive against his wizard and his, uh, you know, against the wizard and the, uh, the one turn chance he'd have, but hmm. 
bought down the guy who's got dodge and stumble the guy who's got block. I don't think Joe's top humans, is he? I just think he should be. <laughs> yeah, Pommer, minus Edge. This is not the tackle one. Oh, this is so dumb. He's just got guard on everybody. He's like he's more like he's just a fucking movement six dwarf team, is what he is. That's the most annoying thing. He wouldn't have even been piling on if he hadn't broken AV. <laughs> I don't even get the pylons, I don't give away a block from this guy. Lords of Dodges again this turn required. Some more gym pals. <laughs> One in nine. Oh my god. No, Curse of AV9 when, when it's literally the two warriors that he's cursed. But yes, they're obviously mostly an armor 18. I'm well aware of that. didn't do any sniping no believe me I would have never snipe Joe's team. His team's completely outstanding. Ah your your RS two thousand your your young I, not that I know young Nathan but I know the name obviously. No more warriors are on the mine. It's just that my warriors are on the fucking 8.5. Yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. He's going to score as well. Get out of town.
What is this? What even is this? Jimmy too steamed to talk, so let's talk about how good ogres are. They are way better than Chaos and also can well turn much better. Jimmy might be sad that Chaos are dead but he will be a better ogre coach for it. Not yet. Um, not any bad injuries yet. Thank you, Tony, by the way. But not any bad injuries yet. But in terms of the game, all three guard players are gone. So now, I'm not going to be able to get a two dice against this entire fucking team. So, the only way is down from here, isn't it? <laughs> what a fucking stupid game. Could have had dice like this against someone who was shit with a shit team, couldn't I? Well, I mean, I have done. <laughs> to be fair, I have done. <laughs> That's why the record is as bad as it is. <laughs> it's just I've managed to fucking pull draws out of my ass in the other games. No, I don't say I'm going to get a draw with this one. Still a chance though, isn't there? Got a chip in a chair. I'm sure he's not just going to make another three cars right now. What makes it annoying is that I know <laughs> that I know Joe makes bad decisions about piling on, in that he doesn't he doesn't pile on indiscriminately, and <laughs> it's annoying that he's getting the the cards without piling on indiscriminately. Oh. Obviously, got a chance. Joe didn't even need the wizard. 
He can just beat you up with all of his guard and wimpy mighty blow pile on without claw. Jim Shard, Jim Shard, Jim Shard. No, I know panning on every time is only with claw, but also it's sometimes against high priority targets and, and and Joe literally only ever piles on when he breaks on them. Thing. There's been a few games where, like, you know, he's hit a skink or whatever and you think he should pile on here. And he doesn't. <sighs> Alright, what can I do here? Two players blitz him and foul him with one assist. You could come in there and blitz him and then foul him, but blitzing just seems a fucking way to lose the game, doesn't it? This is all we have stand for. Clever boy. As much a chance as Brandil getting the star player point to you. Uh, well, no, Jillio, um Obviously, if I'd got the push, I needed to know if he had stand firm to push him there if I only got a push, right? I was expecting gym powers. Um, but. So that's why I was checking for stand firm. And then once I got the power, I thought, oh, well, actually, let's see if he's dumb and doesn't, and doesn't stand firm. He might have done. Might have been, mightn't he? Or might have misclicked. You've got to give people a chance. They're getting smashed by humans. Smashed to fucking pieces. <laughs> by fucking humans. But yeah, Joe's humans. They're barely, they're barely humans. They're more like movement six dwarves. Than humans. Movement 6, Strength 4, Dwarves, rather than... Rather than, uh... Anything else. You can just score at any time, can't you, with the uh, with this fucking bastard. Did you just let me get through round the back? Surely. Get 2D on the ball. 
Well, does it even matter? Maybe. Could just blitz him and then foul him with plus two. Or, but then without dirty player, could blitz him because he's a terrifying, canoring threat. I think I've got to play the ball though now, don't I? GFI into there. If I push into there, it really makes everything harder. If I to him too. I can't go. Actually, making him all the way doesn't. Does it? One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'd like him to get the recovery though somehow, but I guess it ain't gonna happen. Now just block and see what happens. It's a push up blitz for you, really. No? So GFI for the assist. And two GFIs for the hit. Yeah, so I can run out and get it next turn, yeah. I guess I just have to base him with tackle. Maybe I should have followed there to base them guys up. Yeah, no, right, Joe. No, pro into double skulls, please. You greedy bastard. <laughs> It's got to be a mistake, hasn't it? Yeah. I mean, I nearly refused it just to uh, just to get a claw palm blitz in instead. But now my carry is out and about, isn't he here? Problem is, I've got no guard at all. Do the classic irrelevant block first. Take myself out of the game, but what if I kill him? No, I can't. That's a 1D from him or a dodge 2D from him. And then he can dodge to recover. Or you could blitz him. Could go for the 4 plus pick up and then block. Out.
to get the zero assist foul on him. Could do, could do with a Chaos Warrior, couldn't it, really, on the pitch? Or a Strength 4 Guard Beastman. Like, imagine if I had two Strength 4 Guard Beastman. They'd, they'd come in handy right about now. Maybe I should have just stood him. No, I wanted to dodge him out round, but at the end. Do you think you didn't notice? Yeah, I think you didn't notice Flaping Wrath, yeah. Because when you've got... When you've made this many cars against Chaos, yeah. <laughs> I think he's just not caring because he thinks he's won. And to be fair, he almost has won. Like, he can almost just click at random and win now. So yeah, I just think he just didn't give a fuck. I do it all the time, to be fair. When you're dominating somebody, just play a bit of shit on them. Oh, that's a nice little, uh, nice little. Wow, that's a terrible GFI. Lucky, he's getting lucky, isn't he? He's getting the look. Hey. All right. So that was nice of him, wasn't it? I can uh, do that and then hand it off to him and he's away. All right. Well done. Well done, my luck, Joe. Do we blitz him? I guess so. Hmm. Sad times there. Let's just go actually on the sideline. Yeah, probably safest on the sideline, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So for GFI, they can't reach me. But I can have a screen here, anyway. Don't go sideline. Why not? I think the sideline's pretty good. Because if we go sideline, he's got to go 4 4 3. 3 4 5 6 7. Double GFI to base. If I don't go sideline, then he can go 4 4 3. 4 5 6 7. Double GFI to 1, to one dice. He's got dodge. You could you could do you could do those dodges. I think sideline's the best.
Whew. Yeah, maybe. Might get a push though. No, obviously not. <laughs> Might get a push. Yeah, maybe I should have made the GFIs. <laughs> this in the glove of his helicopter flying hands. <laughs> yeah, maybe I should have made it at least one GFI. Because I had the reroll, didn't I? That's fine. Bastard. Yeah, he's not double basing, he's strength four, so he just needs to screen, doesn't he? So that can't go through, which he's done. So now I've just got to do a three plus and a two plus instead of two plus his last turn. see anything except the, the one dice blitz into a GFI and then have to score. I guess so this is this dodge actually is just better then isn't it? But then I get surfed if I fail it. Yeah, I think I just gotta do the dodge. Put it on him. Yeah, yeah, Tony, yeah. Uh, well get surfed though, which is just horrible. But it it stops the GFI, doesn't it? Which is good. And it makes the bolt down worth it as well. I think I just score now though. I think it's too dangerous in rolling dice. It's, I think it's better because it saves the GFI, right? If if the uh, it adds a one in nine, no, it adds a one in thirty. The one in the fact he had wrestle, if he'd had block it, I think it'd been a lot closer. But the fact that he had wrestle, so the one in nine was fine. So it was literally a one in thirty-six because the the one in nine was absolutely fine wrestling him down. Um, and that definitely made it better. Fuck is this? A wrestler each a wrestle each side, that's probably not good for keeping the flanks, is it? So in fact maybe wrestle tackle protected. No no wrestle's better than defenseless though, isn't it?
three, six, nine versus five, ten, eleven. He's got two guys out. I've got five guys out. <laughs> he had 13, I had 14. I'm still men down. With a fucking claw palm killer team. So fucking dumb, isn't it? I think I want the wrestle safety, though. That's the thing, isn't it? So done. I can't go for the win. Yeah, yeah. The, the fact that the one in nine was was avoided. I think that's what made it definitely way better. Maybe I could have tried to stall another turn. But I mean, him scoring in two turns is just as likely as three, isn't it? Yeah, one day, yeah, that was a thing. No, it definitely won't be easy stopping him. It wouldn't be stopping him in two, easy stopping him in two turns. The only thing is, he's got agility three on, well, on one of his humans. <laughs> At least the catches, like the catches, agility four, but throw is agility four. But at least the catches are agility three. So, just gotta hope that, like, oh, that was good. Oh man, if I'd stalled another turn, you would have had no chance. Fuck. Fuck. Yeah, <laughs> there you go then, Jelly. Oh, yeah, that was the thing. It was the GFI that made me. Yeah, it was the GFI that made me not do it. Wow. Fucking pro, the greed pro. He deserves a 1 in 36 every fucking time. Wow, greedy pile on as well. Like irrelevant with one turn left. Whether he gets a stun there or not, I think. Hey! Oh no, he's, it was pro, not a, not a, not a pure greed reroll. No, I wouldn't say so, TLC. Because there was no way I was going to win. I mean, I had no, no illusions that I had any chance of winning. So, it was just trying to defend it. It's easier to defend a two-turn than a three-turn. But, it's still hard to defend a fucking two-turn. A three, it's still hard to defend a two-turn. gone now and he might go through it. He's got a sneaky canoring threat here, hasn't he? GFI. I mean, I'd still rather just take him out and then base him. Do I need to three dice him or not? Don't know. You could GFI to cancel this assist. 
then he could GFI to a given assist there. He could run around to here, and he could two dice, and then he'd be based. So yeah, I think I need to just two dice it. Oh, I can't follow because he's got fucking... Could double GFI to tag him. Is he out of range now? No. So maybe keep him there. Or maybe go there. And then get him in there. He has to GFI to here. Is that the best I can do? I think it probably is. Can I hit the ball with a wrestle goat? That makes it harder for him. He's gonna. He's committed to this guy now. Maybe he blitzes him or something. Blocks him out. Maybe I should have gone one for the four. He's gonna make one dodge. Just got a hope being a human he fails it. Yeah, he blitzes him. Yeah, so maybe I should have moved him over there. I was thinking that all oh, this was quite tricky, but yeah, that was easy, wasn't it? Yeah, so maybe this guy should have gone there. But then he could have dodged this guy away. It was really hard to man then would, then the pass would have been a lot harder though. So yeah, I guess. Actually this guy wasn't a threat. I should have ignored him. Yeah. Wow, he greeted the pass! <laughs> wow! He deserved that! Why did he do the pass? <laughs> what a fucking idiot! I mean, like, with all due respect, it was just adding a roll that didn't need to be made, was it? So it was fucking awful. That was just absolutely awful. Would have still failed. But there was literally no reason to fucking make a pass there. Just literally no reason. Mm, good. No, oh, only a badly hurt. Wow, that was that was terrible. Fully fully in Aryan it. 
And you would have failed anyway. Obviously, you would have failed anyway on the handoff. But to just add an extra 1 in 36 for no reason, where all you have to do is score to win the game. Deserve to fail. Deserves to have a dead ogre. Ah, <laughs> oh, boo, Apple worked. It would have been a fail catch, but he added an extra 1 in 36 to the sequence that didn't need to be in the sequence, did it? Yeah. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not saying that it, the, the, the dice were the dice. Because... So he would have failed anyway, sure, but have I? Have I plenty of times when I've thrown blocks and stuff when I've had to make? When I, I've never, have I? When have I ever, ever, ever in my life made a pass instead of a handoff on turn sixteen of a game? Never, never. Not in a game. Not in a game that's one one. Never, ever, 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 never, ever, 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 he should have done the handoff. He added an extra one in 36. So, while he wasn't lucky that he double wand it, and he would have failed the handoff as well, it was completely, it was a complete Inarian move. Inarian, it really pissed me off that Inarian did it against me. Inarian didn't get punished for it. And, obviously, in the end, Murloc Joe didn't get punished for it because he would have rolled a double one on the catch anyway. But, what if he'd rolled, you know, a one... What if he'd rolled a three on the pass and then he rolled a one and a two on the catch? Because then that would have been, you know, then the handoff would have been successful and then his GFI would have had the reroll for the GFI and stuff. So, you know, yeah, exactly. It just added an extra dice roll to the thing, yeah. Yeah, yeah, fair enough, Chelil. Yeah, like I, I've done it. I've done. I've done a pass like that when I was already winning one nil or two nil or something. But um, because then it's not crucial, is it? But I've never done the Inarian thing of just doing a pass to BM somebody. Um, I broke armor quite a lot actually. Fifty four. He broke fifty five. I just didn't get a good, as good, good a ratio of cars as he did. Yeah. Yeah, it was a 1 in 36 chance of failing. It's not that different. Nah, it's a, it's a lot different because a greed block is a one in tw is a one in twelve nine six, not a one in thirty six, um, isn't it? You know, and he had dice roll after that as well. He had two GFIs to make. You know, it's that was really bad. I, honestly, I'm not I'm not I'm not being an asshole. Um, I'm not being an asshole. I'm not being harsh on him or anything. Right, 13 players for the next game. This is why I didn't sack the present fag. Or see, now he's the 13th guy for the next game. So that was okay. His record was amazing, wasn't it? It's still good. Um, right, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.